How's it going everybody? Hope you're all having an amazing day. In this video, I'm going to go over the easy way to beat the spider matriarch in small lands. Killing this boss leads into some huge upgrades. So if this video helps you out at all, then help me out by hitting that like button. But let's go ahead and cut this plug and get right into it. So once you kill the spider matriarch, you're going to get a spider matriarch fang and more importantly, in my opinion, some spider silk from her eggs. The silk leads into some pretty big upgrades and in order to even harvest the spider eggs, you're going to need flint shears, which actually brings me to all of the required items for this method. Basically what you're going to need is three simple bows and 100 to 150 flint arrows. You could also run a mixture of like 100 flint arrows and 80 wood arrows just to play it safe and whatnot, or maybe even like 300 wooden arrows. I don't know, just have a decent amount of arrows. And, and if you do just wood arrows, you might need more than just three simple bows. The health of the spider will regenerate if you run too far away or don't hit it for long enough. So keep that in mind. Make sure if you're gonna use just wooden arrows that you bring maybe five simple bows, just have enough bows to get the job done. And also, like I said, you're going to need the flint shears to even harvest to the spider eggs at the end. Now here is where things might get a little bit different because I'm not sure whether or not each map is exactly the same or if they are procedurally generated. So in my world, I have the spider matriarch nest right next to a tree house. And if all of the worlds are the same, then this method is going to work exactly the same. But if the worlds are generated differently, then the method might change just a little bit. But I think that the core concept here will be the same. Essentially, this spider's huge body gets stuck very easily in the branches around her nest and with the surrounding environment. And with just a little bit of high ground, it is easy to get a safe spot. Let me know down in the comments if your world is laid out differently. But once the spider is stuck, it's just a matter of two and a half simple bows and 150-ish arrows later, and the boss is down. The little spiders around the boss are not aggressive, so you can just go straight into getting your loot from the boss and harvesting these egg sacs. The silk, though, is a huge upgrade, in my opinion, allowing you to craft the recurve bow, which is an absolute game changer. This bow with some flint arrows will two or three shot the Sawyer beetles, which up to this point have been giving me the most trouble. Let me know down in the comments though what weapon you guys are using, but that is all that I wanted to go over in this video. Hope you guys all have an amazing day. I'm out.